Welcome back to the midday broadcast of your Feel Good Breakfast Show that's now turning this whole day into one big feel good party. Participating in the world of pageants since the age of just 12 and appearing on national TV regularly since the age of 16, Kat Nkala is sure to have picked up industry tricks and tips that are the reason why she always looks and today looks just too polished and ready to strut her stuff. And she's about to give us her five essential tips for grooming. Stop what you're doing, get a little <laughs> bit of pep a pen and paper, yes. press record, whatever you need to do to get this done. I've got to ask straight off the bat because you look gorgeous. Yes. You're a bit of a scene stealer. Who are you wearing today? So today I am wearing a beautiful outfit made by Keletzo, right? So this is an ostrich skirt, I must what? say. It is the heaviest piece of <laughs> item I've probably ever had in my life. You're burning and calories I as you like walk. I feel like him and I really, he, his clothes speak to my personality. Everything is just so over the top, dramatic. It's all just cat. So yes. I Thank love you. it. There's something vintage about it, but it's very contemporary as well. It's Thank beautiful. You. Absolutely amazing. So, I mean, you've probably got a hundred tips that you could uh, depart to, yes, to, to young women out there, but let's, let's focus on five okay. fail-safe tips that you rely on to keep yourself looking and feeling, mm -hmm. I suppose, as part of the, the dynamic, as well-groomed as you are. Give us the first one. Right, so the first one is H2O is the way to go. And I know that probably in every video that you see, they're always like, drink water. Drink and water, drink water. we literally mean it, to drink water. Don't forget that our bodies are actually made up of 70% of water. So, you know, if you're not drinking it, then where is your body getting it from? So it's important to drink water. Um, I don't even think it needs a further explanation because in terms of hair, in terms of skin, in terms of just being healthy, very, very important. And for my friends at home that maybe they're like, but it doesn't taste nice, then mix it up with fruits, strawberry, lemon, mint, blueberries, mix it up with fruits to just give it that extra taste. Just do it for yourself, man. Our brains need it. Yes. Even while we sleep, everything functions on it. Yes. So this one um, you gave mm -hmm. us, and I'm dying to know what it is. Okay. The Cinderella trick. All right, what is that? Cinderella trick, right? Have you ever had that moment? You probably haven't, but... <laughs> <laughs> you never for, know. For my, for my girlfriends, right? When they have lipstick on and, and then, you know, you're just like, oh, you got a little bit of lipstick on your teeth. What do you do? How do you avoid that, right? So I call it the Cinderella trick. It's okay. putting your finger in your mouth and just like popping it out. You'll see that lipstick literally covers your finger. And after that, lipstick is removed from like the round of your uh, mouth and it can't go on your teeth anymore. But now people are like, okay, cool tip, but why Cinderella, right? Why, why Cinderella? Now, Graham, tell me this. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> Have you ever heard of Cinderella looking shabby? When before the fairy godmother comes? But after? After, no, never. Never. Have you ever been like Cinderella, like her wee was not laid down properly? No, never. There was a stain on her dress. Never gonna happen. Did Cinderella ever have lipstick on her teeth? She never had a bad day. Mm -mm. So I called it the Cinderella, Cinderella trick. trick. <laughs> well, and you're a living Cinderella, so I get that, man. I love that. Um, this one made me laugh because I struggled with really bad acne when I was I was a, a teenager yes. myself. Don't pop the pimple. Don't pop the pimple. So I know at some stage in our lives, we all go through like a breakout, especially when seasons are changing. It's just like, what's going on with my skin? And you know, you'll get a few pimples here or there. And the first thing that, you know, anyone wants to do is just like to pop it. Yeah. Don't pop pop the pimple because it is literally de de detrimental to your skin. It leaves that scar on your skin. So do not do it. It will go with time. It will go and you shall get your glowing skin back. Let, let the body do what it let does. Let the body do what it does. PJs are the new daytime. <laughs> Hello, guys. <laughs> so this is for everyone that's just like, I woke up like this. That is literally me. So the whole of Instagram. That's really. like, I woke up like this and PJs really, they are the new daytime. There are these cool silk PJs that if you go to my Instagram, I think every week, like I just have a picture in my, sil in like my silk P PJs <laughs> because really they are the most <laughs> comfortable and you just pop them on with a sneaker or a heel and people are like, are those PJs? Girl. Like, girl. Yeah, the silk does does help, but I feel PJs you. PJs are the new daytime. And, and I like the fact that you've got to be authentic. If you're going to put it on yes. Insta, make it real, man. Make yes. it real. Okay, our final tip, and this one I certainly endorse from my side, but I'd like to hear your perspective. Coconut oil makes the best primer. Definitely. So I'm sure you've heard that, you know, there's a lot of primers and everything, but coconut oil makes the best primer, especially for, you know, girls and makeup. Before you put your foundation on, if you want it to literally stay on, really? coconut oil 
oil is the way to go. Now, this is something that is really inexpensive. You can get it from even like, you know, anyway. Comes in a small bottle, just put some coconut oil and your makeup will stay the whole day. It won't melt, even when you sweat. That's it's literally crazy. a matter of it dabbing. That's it. That is insane. Mm -hmm. And there are a lot of makeup companies out there going like, no, don't tell her that. <laughs> you must buy our primer. Um, and it also has all sorts of other health benefits as, uh, yes. as well. I've picked up some absolute gems. Some of them I won't use. Or maybe if I get dressed up one day and I need the Cinderella trick, I might try it. <laughs> um, she can do just about anything else. But can she cook? We're going to find out in just a moment if she can whip up something scrumptious for me and this big studio crew of ours in our kitchen. We're going to welcome her into the Espresso Kitchen in just a moment to whip up some delectable gourmet hot dogs. That's all on the way.